We literally have goats in the house. Love it. Thank you, mommy. It tastes like crap. Don't get me wrong, but you know, it works. He has my box. He has my box. Let me go. Let me go. Let me go. Let me go. I need to catch him because he rings and knocks like crazy. And I need to sign the package. So. You knew you had to sign uh, for this, right? Yep. Sure okay. Ooh. Let's see. Let's see. Oh, it just goes dark. All right. Thank you, ma'am. Thank you so much. You have a good day. You too. And have a lovely weekend. My mom has to put like a sticker on the box. They make you do it in the post office to kind of say what's inside. And it says kids books, kids t-shirt, um, a purse, um, airtight meat so she probably send over some cold cuts again um i don't know what the top and the bottom is guys she's spoiling her grandson so this is for idris oops i kind of cut in it i think okay i need to see the purse first My it's so cute oh my god there's stuff inside here too I think it feels like oh she got me slippers I thought I said to not do it my mom is so silly Oh yeah, they fit. Ooh, memory foam. I love memory foam. Oh, and a sweater. That was actually really smart, Mom, because it kept the shape. Oh, this is super big. Oh, yes. Oh, bitch. Do you see the sleeves? Oh, okay, 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 okay. She sent over some chocolate. It's like, like Kit Kat. It looks like, it's like Kit Kat. Some more meat, airtight meat, cold cuts. I remember this. This, this, this I liked. This I really, really liked. Not the other one so much. You then had to read everything and then the little um, thing Whatever you see, you have to press over here. Does that make sense? This, again, somebody told me that the closest thing that I can find to this is Wawa, like the Wawa crackers, and I hate the Wawa crackers, so that's not gonna work for me. What is this? Probably for Halloween. So cute. Ooh, this is nice. A light jacket. This better not be the price that it says on here because I'm really gonna flip out for Benjamin, also from Primark. Take with him to work. I thought this was so nice because it's simple, um, but it's glass and Yep, you can put it in the dishwasher. He used to take like just like a teacup with him, like a mug. And I'm like, why would you do that? Because if you stop or something happens and that hot water spills over you, like it just doesn't make sense. So this is going to be great, great. Love it. Thank you, mommy. Especially for my purse. I'm going to put my new, my, my, my permit in here, you know. Hey guys, good morning. Uh, yes, first of all, I know my glasses are crooked. Don't judge. Second of all, I kind of might have slept with my makeup on, but it's only eyebrows, mascara, and some concealer. 
<laughs> anyway, today is Tuesday, November 6th, which means it's election day and I'm so nervous about my everything. And I already told Idris as if he can understand me. I said, boy, I hope you know that Tuesday CNN is going to be on the whole day. He's like, oh, good, TV, TV. I'm like, okay. I have to go get him. He's awake. Good morning, Bubu. Hi. You're such a fake crier. What's wrong? Kick. That is Idris. <gasps> I don't know what's happening. Hey guys, what's up? <sighs> See, this is the funny thing. I'm like going off track real quick right now, but look at my face. The um, foundation is actually a very dark foundation, so I decided to only use a light amount today because I thought it was not going to match my chest, but it was going to match my forehead. My forehead literally has no foundation on it. So why is my forehead still so dark? Like, I just put, like, a little bit of the contouring from here. I put here. But, like, right, there's, this is nothing. This is nothing. This is my skin. Like, why is my forehead so dark? Anyways. Hey, guys. Oh, I think my husband just came home. Yeah, he literally just got in. Okay. It's Friday the 9th. Today, I did a large Walmart grocery order, and Benjamin went ahead and picked it up. You can, you know, do pickup or delivery for $9.99, but the pickup is free, and it's Benjamin's lunch now, so I was like, just go during lunch, because literally, I put Idris' last diaper on, and he's down for his nap right now, so I need my diapers. There he is. Hey, husband. Awesome. Let's put everything on the counter. I cleared it all out. I'm coming to help you. Oh my god, oh my god. mom would literally have a heart attack this is way too much plastic for her it's filled with stuff I don't even know what's in it I'm sorry mom this is not me okay Okay, so this is how it's looking like right now. I'm just going to show you guys exactly what I bought. Now, this total was like over $330 without taxes, okay? But it's because a lot of like the big items were out. Um, like toilet tissue, his diapers, this alone 
is $40. Okay, so crazy. Then also his wet wipes. I usually always get Parents' Choice, the original one, which, which is like a purple box. But I went back to this one. I've tried every single one of their, I wanted to say flavors, since. Um, but they used to have like when Idris was still a, like a baby, like four months, five months, they had this one that just, it smelled like baby and I loved that one and I cannot seem to find it again. Um, so I don't know if they discontinued it or if they just got rid of that scent because it was too strong but it smelled like baby like literally I would hand people my baby and they were like oh my god he smells so good and it was all because of the wet wipes because you know I would wipe his hands or his face when we were out in public when he was eating so so annoyed flour 11 kilos I also got a new trash can super random but we needed one in our second bathroom so I got that we got chips for us not for Idris this is something that Benjamin picked out I don't think he has ever had these but I guess he wanted to try them out I love these just regular um, tostitos tostitos right with a hint of jalapeno super good I always eat it with avocado and sour cream and yes another one for Benjamin and another one for me I love these also with avocado and sour cream I got another three minutes and a half I'm gonna cut it in half and then use two sides one side have salmon on it the other side mozzarella how are you liking that that's a great idea I have to see no, 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 I just, I needed to show okay. I needed to show them, okay. Two cereals. These are ours because Idris only eats um, regular Cheerios. Let me try to go over this quick, okay, guys? Because I got two minutes to make Benjamin's food. We got some Bri, only for me. Benjamin does not eat this. Gouda, well, I mean, Gouda. I don't really know how Americans say it. Gouda? Gouda? I don't know. Gouda. We got some um, Colby Jack cubes, some regular cream cheese for my bagels, some mozzarella because we were talking about it and I was like, yep, add it because I was talking about some, some, like some mozzarella with some tomatoes, with some basil, with then the vinegar sauce and I was like, yep, add, add, add. Smoked salmon, we're going to have this now. These are some Lunchables, believe it or not. These are for me. Idris does not really like that. Oh my god, I got a minute, 44 seconds. This is not refrigerated, but this is um, the bread that I just got so we can eat it now. So I just put one loaf in the, in the oven. Some yogurt cups for me. Then this yogurt for Benjamin and Idris because it does not have any fruit chunks. They like that. Some guacamole. The juices, we always get double. We love this strawberry kiwi juice cocktail, mango twist juice cocktail, and then regular apple juice. And as I said, we always buy two, two of these pierogies, some seasoned french fries. This is a big bag. This is 64 ounces. This is like over a kilo. Some sweet potato fries, green beans, and broccoli, seasoned broccoli. Benjamin got two of these. By the way, in Belgium, they're huge. This is, although it doesn't say mini on this, this is a mini size. Like, I'm not understanding. Like in Belgium, they're really big, so it's, it's weird. Bread has to cool down anyways. We got a bag of tortellinis. So that was refrigerator and freezer food. This you do not put in the refrigerator. I used to do it, but it's not good apparently. So some cherry tomatoes, a bag of yellow potatoes, two boxes of the gnocchi pesto, two boxes of the gnocchi for cheese. Idris and I love this. One box of penne, one box of rotini and one box of orzo. We only use this in our rice. Like the Turkish way of doing rice, if you're wondering about it, go check out my video. I will link it somewhere here. Some flushable wet wipes. We got some cotton swabs. I needed a rolling pin, right?
Fuck it, I'm gonna keep it. I mean, you know, it's nice for when Idris is a little bit older and he can help me. This is a great size for him, so there's that. Some cotton pads. This might be super random, but if you know of any good cotton pads that do not like leave lint on your face, can you let me know because it's super annoying, especially I'm wearing contacts and you know they just get caught up in my eyelashes and stuff. Some nasal mist spray. This is great for babies, but it's great for adults as well. My favorite deodorant, the uh, the scent of this is just, I don't want to spray it, I got food out, but it's, it's really good. And then I just got this for Benjamin. To be honest, the reasons why I bought this is because the packaging was cool and it said gold. But I want to say like 99% because of the packaging and it smells insane. Like it smells really good, like just like a nice like smell you know what I mean it's like ooh. Jergens shea butter this is the extra extra for really dry skin okay so this is what I have to put on myself at night because it's just not a fun situation right now I'm very dry and very crackly this is our body wash that we love using Benjamin and I this is the Aveeno um, and it lasts a long time I think the other one we bought maybe in I don't know like two or three months ago which is it's a long time like two adults we do one or two showers a day it lasts a long time we got some tomato paste and some diced tomatoes we got the hello natural watermelon fluoride pre tooth toothpaste for Idris if you have any like good ways to have children brush their teeth let me know because right now he's just sucking the toothpaste off. Some wet ones to keep in my new purse that I got from mom. If you saw the previous, previous clip. <laughs> Some matcha green tea because I'm not doing any coffee anymore in the morning. I'm just doing this for my energy. It tastes like crap. Don't get me wrong, but you know, it works. Some non garlic and herb. I'm sorry if I keep doing this. It's, I'm trying to make sure I'm in focus. Um, naan bread. This looks really good. Baked with garlic and a basil and oregano blend. Yes. Some tomato sauce. As you can see, I love Sam's Choice brand. This is the Nap Napoletana tomato sauce. So it has some cherry tomatoes in it. And this is the tomato basil pasta sauce. Some strawberry jam. Some, um butter unsalted butter that i use for baking usually i get my um tissues at the dollar store but i wanted to try the lotion one because the commercial is cute and it i mean the commercial is cute what else can i say these are snacks for idris his cheddar buddies his fruit snacks and then his lightly salted um, rice cakes really don't want to pick that up like right there this box is capri suns but i don't want to like I, I don't want to do that some of this which i actually put in the baby's diaper pail or in a trash can um we have a diaper pail that does not have any liners with a scent so this is how i go about it we were running out of our um, dishwasher detergent. And last but not least, this, which is amazing if you have a child that makes a lot of stains when he eats because he loves to eat and he's not that careful, even if it's a day old strawberry, tomato, Gatorade, whatever. Just spritz it on, it'll come right out, guys. Grass, dirt, anything, okay? So. Now I'm just going to turn off the camera and put everything away and be annoyed. So Idris is up right now, but I can't go get him yet because the mailman is literally here right now. And I think he has another package for me. Like Idris has been getting birthday gifts. If not every day, then every other day. It's been crazy. So I don't want to get him and then go get the box because he's going to want to play with the box and I know the mailman is sick and tired of getting out of his car for me because 
we've been kind of doing the most over here. He has a lot of gifts, but it's almost like to compensate that his family is not here, which is so sad to say, but you know, he's the 11 grandchild on his dad's side. So if we were in Belgium, he would have like a lot of people to play with. You know what I'm saying? He better not mess up because I literally have it right here on my email. He stopped. <laughs> he pulled up. He started the car and he was driving and then he stopped. Yep, yep, give me my Amazon package. And this is from my cousin back in Belgium, my cousin and my aunt. He's probably gonna ring the doorbell and knock because that's what he always does. He's very loud. He only rings once if he doesn't need your signature. If he needs your signature, he does dini dini, dini dini. I had a package come in, by the way, from Bum Boxes, and I thought it was a gift for Idris, so I didn't even look at the label. I just start ripping it open, and then I saw the pink, the pink box, and I was like, oh, it's mine, and I want to unbox it on camera, so. Uh, by the way, I'm going to do a holiday gift guide for toddlers preschoolers him and her three separate videos so you will see some of Idris's gifts more in depth okay so this is the pillow I know it's just a pillow guys but it's machine washable organic cotton made in the US hypoallergenic you can use it like this or you can put something on it uh, like a cover I mean and it's smaller than the one that we currently have for him I have absolutely no idea what this is. Oh, this is a, a rug. Oh my God, this is how packaged it comes? Holy cannoli, okay. Okay, okay, battery sign. We got this, a co cocoa coloring book. He's going to love to play soccer. You can play this indoors, outside. Um, it's a hovering soccer ball, so even if it bumps against walls or the chair or whatever, it will still hover. I wanted to s hover. I wanted to s hover. I wanted to. S His toy downstairs is making noise. What the actual f <laughs> What is happening? <gasps> oh my god! We literally have goats in the house. <laughs> 